If you run a dental practice and you'd like to know how AI can really help your business right now, then this presentation, Stroke Live Demo, is for you because I'm going to show you how AI chatbots can really benefit a business like a dentist's. So, first of all, let's just get on the same page and what do we mean by an AI chatbot? Well, let's just take this website here, for example. Down the bottom right-hand side, we've got a chat window there that visitors to the website, or again, if it's connected up to your social media channels, can ask questions and uh, go ahead and book appointments and do all kinds of things using AI. No human required to be able to do this. And of course, it can do it uh, 24 hours a day. So that's what we mean by AI chatbots. But let's have a look at the specific benefits for those running a dental practice. For one thing, um, you are now going to be able to offer 24-7 automated appointment booking according to, you know, the slots that you have in your availability calendar. So you're going to increase appointments because you're going to be able to deal with them after hours, not just over the phone, you know, during normal working hours, for example. People are going to be able to do it anytime they want from the convenience of their home or even just from their mobile phone. Then you're going to be able to just fill those extra slots up, which is obviously going to help you increase revenue. And from a patient's point of view, it's going to be so much easier for them to just be able to jump on your website quickly press on the chat button and liaise with the AI to make a suitable appointment. So that really does solve the first issue, which is being able to take bookings 24 hours a day as a dental practice. The other thing that it can do is it can answer patients questions really quickly and very, very accurately and respond to those common sort of inquiries that you get, um, which normally would be dealt with over the phone by staff who are usually very busy and often dealing with people actually in your dental practice stood at the counter. Uh, if you've ever had that situation or you've seen it with your own staff where they're taking calls and you've got patients stood there waiting to be dealt with, it's not a nice scenario. It doesn't do the patients the world of good. And we can take that away by uh, letting the patients be able to ask questions online through your AI chatbot. So it's going to reduce the phone calls and emails and obviously make patients uh, a little bit more happy and satisfied. And that can never be a bad thing for your reviews, of course. And by the way, in just a moment, I'm going to build a live chatbot for you. I'm actually going to build one on a dental practice so you can see exactly how it's done. Uh, or of course, our team can do it for you. But here we go. So the other thing that it can do is empower your uh, patients with knowledge. Now, we all know um, that after we've been to the dentist, the dentist will usually tell us what needs to happen next. Well, wouldn't it be good if they were able to get a reminder of that or just get clarification on what the dentist has said over their phone there with a chatbot? Well, that's totally possible with this because you are able to train the chatbot on the specific knowledge relating to your dental practice so that the chatbot will only respond to questions about, you know, dentistry and uh, all of the things that you want it to reply to. For example, it's not going to say, um, you know, if somebody types in who's the president of America, it's not going to answer that. But if they ask a question about, you know, post care after having some kind of dental treatment, then it will be very good in uh, telling them exactly what they should do. And also it can uh, be used for kind of educating people on how to look after their teeth in general anyway. So, you know, how many times a day should you brush your teeth? What are the recommended toothpaste? All of that kind of thing. Um, can be put into your chatbot so that it can give the same advice that you would in person, but from the convenience of, uh, you know, their phone or their computer. And it just builds trust because you come across as an authority. You're giving them all this help and support and solid, good guidance. And you can um, then obviously get a lot of brownie points, as it were, with your patients. And you get to see all of these conversations that your chatbot has had with your patients so you can have a good kind of 30,000 for overview of exactly what's going on and what's being said uh, under your business. The other great thing about chatbots is they speak more than one just language. We're talking 95 languages. So any of your patients uh, are from a, a foreign country, which often, you know, people are, then they're able to communicate with the chatbot, ask questions about your dental practice or booking appointments or any kind of post-treatment care all in their own native language. And the chatbot will automatically respond in the same language as well. 
So that could potentially reduce a lot of patient misunderstandings, um, particularly, you know, perhaps when it comes to post care, when you, the dentist, have said to them in your uh, chosen language that um, what they should do when they they leave the practice well, they may not be 100% sure about that, may not remember that, but now they're able to just go on to the chatbot and then just get further clarification on that. So it reduces admin as well, having an AI chatbot that can do all of this stuff, handle all the boring routine questions like what time do you open? How do I book an appointment? All of that can be dealt with automatically. And then it gives the, the staff, as I said, more time to be able to deal with patients that are right there in front of them and give them fast service, which really does go down well with patients. And it will obviously improve operational efficiency across the board because you're going to have staff with a little bit more time on their hands. And obviously that's very, very valuable. And then um, being able to hook up your chatbot to not just the front end of your website, but also to connect it to perhaps Facebook and all of the other different main channels, even WhatsApp then anybody can get in touch with you or contact your business and still have the functionality of that chatbot. So they could go onto your Facebook page, send a message and the chatbot will automatically respond on your behalf. Also with comments that might be left on any of your Facebook posts, for example, or Instagram, the chatbot is able to respond there in much the same way as it would on your website. So you've got this kind of fully automated a system that's dealing with inbound inquiries and helping people with their appointments. You can even look up appointment times and things as well if perhaps somebody has forgotten, you know, when they were when they booked. So really, really good, solid system. But now let's get on to actually creating one right here, right now on this uh, video here. So I've just found this website here, uh, the 24 Dentist dot com um, they don't have a chatbot chatbot system at the moment so i'm just going to create one for this using fastbots so this is the back end all we need to do is just put in a title here so i'm going to say 24 7 um, dental care like that and then click let's go we're going to put in their website right here like this and then just click start now what is happening there is that FastSpots is automatically going around the whole website from page to page, much as a human would, but what it's doing is going, right, okay, I'm gonna grab all of this content, all of this content, and I'm gonna index it all so that the chatbot can use this knowledge. So you know that the knowledge that's going into your chatbot is coming from a reputable source and is accurate because it's coming from your own website. And so it will go round, as you can see, it's found already uh, 30 pages on the website there. It's got them all in like so. And then all we need to do is just uh, click this little uh, symbol at the top there to select all of the pages that we want in. And it will keep going and going until it's found every last page, even down to things like this, the uh, a PDF file there with the privacy um, notice just there like that. So it will even get all of that as well and just work its way through the whole site. Um, at the moment, we've got 71. Now we've got 86 links that it's found already. And now we're all done and it's found 132 links of the website there in total. So we just click the top little status link there and just click add for training. So now all of that content, including those PDFs there, are being absorbed into the chatbot so that we can start asking questions about it and testing out our chatbot. And we can also customize the appearance of the chatbot. You can see at the moment we've got 24 seven dental care, but we can go ahead and add a logo. So let's say um, if we were to just grab this logo here, just going to do this live so you can see it. I'm going to grab this little icon here, which I think would look very good. There we are. And now I can go and upload that to replace this robot very, very quick and easy. And we can really customize this to make it match the brand. And there you go. You can see straight away it's added that in there like so. Then we can also customize the color of everything that we want to. So we'll go with this color here for the little circle just there. And then we can change the user background color like this if we want to do that. And then uh, finally the send message button. We'll also do that as well. So I'm gonna pick that color there. There we are. So that chatbot now looks obviously a lot better to be matched up with this website. That took all of uh, about one minute. 
and then we can just click save down here like this in fact we'll also change the start chat icon as well there you go just to make it look a little bit better and then we can also make it uh, create a little sound here when um, somebody goes onto the website. So it draws attention to that chatbot. So I'm happy with that in the way that it looks. Now what I'm going to do is going to actually look at how it functions. So this is where we teach our chatbot what its role is, what it should be doing. And if we just um, take a look down here, we've got a whole load of different templates there. And we'll be adding another one just there specifically for dentists as well. So look out for dentists in there. But if we were to just go for uh, the healthcare one at the moment, just there, and then we can alter this here. Now think of this as being the instructions that you would give to an employee who was on the other end of the live chat. And you would tell them exactly what to do. So, for example, when the person types in a question on your chatbot and it doesn't know the answer, then what should it say? So, for example, that would be this. If we just take that, put it into this section here. Apologies, I'm not sure about that. Please contact our support team. I would change that to our office team just there and then we put in the contact details so right here if we just take a little look let's see if we can find the contact details for these guys there we go we'll say general inquiries like this and we'll just put those details in there like that so the chatbot's not going to come up with answers all by itself that it that it's thought of it's going to be using your data to come up with those answers or it's not going to answer and it's just going to say, sorry, um, here's what you need to do. Contact the office team. And then we can adjust this here as well. So we'll just let's just go over to here a second. So the 24 seven dentist. So we'll put that in there as well. 24 seven dentist. There we are. And then it says there your job is to provide details about clinic services, available treatments and healthcare guidelines only using the provided uh, data. And then, you know, there we are. We have all of the other stuff there as well. And you can adjust this whole thing here just to be exactly the way that you need it for your particular dental practice. And then we can save it just here. So we'll put 24 seven dental just there and we can keep that. Anytime we want to amend it, we can do. And then just up here, we've got our different AI models. So we use a GPT-40 in this example just here. And then we'll save those changes. And now our chatbot is almost certainly going to be ready to use. And there we are. We've already indexed 100 pages of the site. Just there, you'll find that there are um, some pages that are failed. That is usually because the website is, they're, they're just bad pages that were left on the website. But all of these pages are right here. So now let's get to using our chatbot. Let's try it out. So I just come to over to uh, this little section here. How do I go about booking an emergency appointment, please, on a Sunday? And there we are. The chatbot's responding straight away. Uh, to book an emergency dental appointment on a Sunday, you can contact the 24-7 dentist. And then there's the way of doing it. And then you can also book online. And what we can also do here is to connect this chatbot with your booking system. Uh, booking systems like Dentally or Dengro, we can connect them up or Google or, or any of these main platforms and we can actually interact with the chatbot right now and say, when have you got an appointment for next Wednesday? And the chatbot will come back and say, yeah, we can do, you know, nine o'clock, 10 o'clock, 11 o'clock, which one would you like? Take the patient's uh, details and all of that's uh, secure inside our admin system. And then uh, email that straight to your team and let you know there's been a booking and automatically add it to your booking system. So all of that can be done with the chatbot. And then from your point of view, as I said, you get to see all of the chats that are taking place. Here's the one that I just had. And then we can take a look at it in full here and see uh, what the chatbot has said and what the patient has said. And then that can be emailed straight over to you automatically or your team by just putting in your email address there. And if somebody happens to speak in a foreign language or type in a foreign language, then we can automatically translate that conversation before it even comes over to us by email. So we know exactly what has been said. Also, you can have people complete a, a little lead form as well before they even use your chatbot. So just here, you'll see it says lead collection. 
we can have people fill out their name and number and then be able to use the chatbot if you wanna collect the data of every single person who uses it. Another great way to collect leads and to sort of manage and understand exactly who's using the bot. We can add things like this, so opening hours, emergency treatment, anything that people commonly would want to know about your business, you can put in here so that when they go to use the chat bot, all they need to do is just literally press that pre-done question and then it will go ahead and answer as you can see like that so really really quick so as you can see very very useful system and very very um, powerful for increasing sales getting more patients into your dental practice also keeping them happier we can create uh, chatbots with educational content as i said all about dental treatment and so on and in fact, on this website here, there is uh, quite a lot of dental advice. There you go, the ultimate guide on how to brush your teeth. So I know that our chatbot has that information. So if I were to say, um, how should I best brush my teeth? We should get a response based on the content of that article. And there it is, to brush your teeth effectively. It's just going through the whole process, there you go. Start with the outer surfaces, angle the toothbrush, clean inner surfaces, brush chewing surfaces, and so on. So it's giving you know great advice right there instantly without me having to search the entire website for that advice. It's great having a blog post. It's good because it's kind of attracting potential traffic from search engines. But if I'm here on this website, I am not going to be able to find that information very quickly versus using an AI chatbot from Fastbots. So there you go, why use Fastbots? Well, um, the chatbots can be tailored 100% to your individual dental practice, really easy to uh, implement into your site, one line of code, and you can add the chatbot to your website. Usually that can be done by your web developer in about two minutes, and then it's live on your site, all conversations are being recorded, and you've got 24 seven support that you're now offering your potential clients and your, your long-term clients, people who are already booked with you. Um, and it's a modern approach to better better patient care. I mean, everybody is gonna be using AI very soon. So it's, it's time to jump on and get involved and use it with a um, secure business and a secure company like Fastbots. So if you want to sign up, then go ahead and sign up and try doing your dental practice. You saw how easy it was. We provide um, onboarding calls, support, and real simple step-by-step -step guides. You can refer back to this video. Just go to fastbots.ai. This is the website right here. And then you can just go ahead and sign up anywhere on the site for free to try it out. There you go, get started for free. This is the site and then you'll just sign up and away you go. Then you can start building for your dental practice. So I hope you enjoy this video. I hope you can see why AI chatbots are great for dentists and dental practices and other kind of healthcare practices, to be honest. And um, we look forward to uh, hopefully working with you very soon. That's it for this video. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in another one.